right, first of all, tell us what brings you out here tonight. Okay, so I'm gonna dance till I drop uh, to find a cure for pediatric cancer. I really think it's just so amazing to be out here and, you know, just do something to help. I really feel like it's just a great cause to be out here and, you know, help people who have this, this disease. And I really feel like, you know, it's important to be out here and fight for this. What's your dance move, your go-to dance move? My Can you show me one, teach me one. All right, so one. let's see here. Do you know Watch Me Whip? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna do the whip right now. You ready? Yeah. So put your hand up, watch me whip. Boom, boom, and then nay nay. We're gonna nay nay one more time. All right, okay. watch me whip, whip. Oh, two whips, okay, nay -nay. one more time. Watch me whip, watch me whip, watch me nay nay. Yes, okay, I love it. Awesome. So tell us a little bit, people that are watching, what, you're on a show about, yeah. what is it called? It's called uh, The Amazing World of Gumball. I play, uh, I voice Gumball Watterson. Okay, and where did, what yeah. network is it on? It's on Cartoon Network. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. So is this like, this isn't probably one of your first big projects. You've probably been working since you're like a baby, right? Uh, I started when I was five. And, How old are you now? Um, I'm 14. Okay. Yeah, so. It's been nine years. Yeah, yeah, it's been a long time. Um, but Gumball actually is, has been one of the biggest things I've ever done. Um, because I was like, when I got it, 11. And um, I was a huge fan of Gumball before I even got the role. So um, when they called me in, I was like, oh my gosh, I love the prize face. Whenever someone's like, hey, guess what? You booked the show. What is your face? I'm just like, oh my gosh, and it's like, this is so cool. So I was really excited, worked my butt off for this role, and then it's like, when I finally got it, I was like, the single tear rolled down, I was like, yeah, so, it actually was one of the biggest things I've ever gotten, and I love it so much. Um, it's been such an amazing journey so far. I really love it. I think you need to tell your agents that they need to get you a part playing like Brad Pitt's little brother. You need to get me a part playing Brad Pitt's brother. Okay, do you hear me, Beverly Strong? You need to do that. You look like him, right? You get that all the time? I get like Leonardo DiCaprio, yeah. and I get some Brad Pitts around then, and I'm just like, when I was little, I was like, who's Leonardo DiCaprio? And then it's just like, I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> I see why you're an actor. You're very charming. Okay, so let's just say one thing. If in like 20 years, someone is playing back this really old interview, and you're like the new Leo or Brad, what do you want to tell yourself? Tell yourself something. Okay. You in 20 My, years. Myself? know that you look like Leonardo DiCaprio because right now I don't know it but I know you will in the future and know that you are an awesome dude and Any advice for yourself okay advice for myself yeah in uh, 20 years I'm not gonna be as smart as you in the future myself but just know this always follow your dreams and never give up in your voice acting slash acting career I love it congratulations and have so much fun today thank you so much thank you bye, thank you. Bye.